welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to create hierarchy here in smartsheet let's begin now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time here with smartsheet i want you to click the sign up option and from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go Creating a hierarchy in Smartsheet is a straightforward process that allows you to organize tasks and subtasks in a structured way. All right. So basically, once you are logged into your Smartsheet account, just go to where you want to create the hierarchy. All right. In this case, I'm going to be looking on this file. I'm going to click on it. And then now you can start by entering the main tasks or categories in the row of your sheet. Now, for example, this is going to be the hierarchy boss, for example, right? I'm going to uh, make sure that this row is specifically made for that. I'm going to put in a color so it's uh, a little bit separated from the rest, right? So I'm going to make it bold and a striking color for the uh, red, right? Now, I'm going to put in... I should be able to put in an indent here. I'm not sure why. Now I'm going to put in an outdent here. You see? Alright, so this is going to be the boss. And I'm going to put in... Maybe something like... Two... All right, so this is how you can create hierarchy in Smartsheet. It's a very straightforward process, really, because you can always use the indent button and the outdent button here. See that? You can see, you can use that, and of course, you can use all of these. Should be um hierarchy three and hierarchy four, right? Now, once you have created your hierarchy, it provides a visual representation of the project structure, making it easier to see how tasks are related and, of course, how they contribute to overall goals. You can organize tasks hierarchically, allows for better planning and, of course, scheduling. You can set dependencies between tasks right here, ensuring that subtasks are completed in the correct order and that deadlines are met. And that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching and we will see you again in the next one.